place and make it spotless. Sure Clive, we'll have a spick and span in a jiffy, fit for a star. Well cast more when it comes to getting places sorted, particularly for prestigious events such as the Cathedral Movie Awards. No one's better than us, right Clive? Best in the whole of Best in the whole of Yorkshire. Best of what? But wouldn't it be great to be up there? What? Up in the rafters? No, on the roof. No. What do you mean then? On the screen. What, cleaning it? It looks pretty clean to me. Use Jiff All Purpose Cleaner works really well at getting rid of stubborn stains. You're not getting it. I want to be a true star with everyone looking at me, breaking free from this job, making something of myself, being noticed. Need to keep grounded. I'd love to poke his hemsworth though, saving the whole of Ripon and Bloom from a wild gang of horticultural terrorists. I'd parachute down onto the roof and beat them all down with my broom before saving the heroine. Maybe I should just be happy with what I've got. I'm soaring, flying, there's not a star in heaven that I can't reach. If I'm trying, so I'm breaking free. You know the world can see me in a way that's different than who I am, creating space between. Separate hearts, but my faith it gives me strength, strength to believe. I'm so. and Brad Twit! Gosh wow, fantastic welcome. Gosh wow, it's so nice to see so many celebrities. Tonight is an important night. Not only do you get to spend over two hours in the presence of Semoir, Brad Twit, voted the cutest guy in the whole of Ripon, but we'll also see overpaid celebrities being rewarded for their efforts in film. Along with their big houses, made in huge bank accounts, we like to give them something special for their mantelpiece. A signed photograph of me. Oh, and a cathedral movie award. Gosh, wow, amazing, wow, gosh. I'd love one of the, those, yeah, wow, fantastic. We are also privileged to have direct from Hollywood, the movie magic, which makes every film so special and entertaining. <laughs> What would we do without the movie magic, hey Rooney? 
gosh, wow, yes, Brad. I can't imagine the world was there when there was no movie magic, can you? Oh, look, here comes The Rock, a.k.a. Jerome Johnstone, starring Fast and Furious movies. Who he came on the written number 36 bus? Not that Fast and Furious today. <laughs> Hello to all my adoring fans. Please come to see my latest movie. It is a classic, a play man who must save the universe from evil forces, helped by a giant gorilla. It is a very realistic, deep story. Oh, look, there is Scarlett Johanna from those Marvel movies. Hi darlings, I've just flown in from LA, very jet lagged, too tired for autographs. Just come for my trophy, then I'm straight to basement afternoon tea, then home. Oh look, wow, great, wow, it's Katie Zeta Moans. She's been nominated for a role in the Rip and the Musical, Story of Revenge. That's the Thursday market and a horn blower. I thought the critics had panned her, said she had as much acting talent as a plank of wood. How dare you, my darling, I've great stage and screen, I'm the best rip and talent that ever there's been. Gosh, wow, amazing there. Anyways, all the celebrities are taking their seats, so I think it's time to get on with the show, don't you, Brad? Sure is, Rini. To award our first award, Best Actress in a Leading Role, please welcome Tom Cruise. <laughs> for the best actress in a leading role are Julia Robus in Nottingham Chill, Scarlett Johanna in The Avengers Assemble. Yet again. Oh, is this a mistake? Oh, the film is a stinker. Even worse than Cats. Cake is eating moans for the ripping of the musical. I believe we have a few clips to show you. Everything isn't real, you know, despite my four houses, millions in the bank. I'm just a girl. Y yes, dear, yeah. really exciting book. Just got to a really exciting bit. I'm more than what you see on the screen. I have feelings. I'm a girl who needs attention, don't you think? Wait, did you say something, dear? Mm-hmm. possession very soon. You mean this key card? You can make this easy or you can make it difficult. <laughs> what can a little one like you do anyway? <laughs> I've got the key card turn. I'll see you soon at Avengers HQ. And the songs I have sung. Hey up! You need to come quickly, the horn blower's lost his watch. Oh no! He doesn't know when to blow his horn to start the Thursday market. Oh, this is a disaster. It just wants to make me sing. We ain't got time for that, come on! And the winner is Julia Robus! <laughs> This is great, just what I've always wanted. I'll add it to my many other awards. I'd like to thank a few people who helped me get in. My agent, my stylist, my chauffeur, and oh, not forgetting my makeup team. It should be mine, mine I tell you. I paid good money so that I could win by bribing the judges and mine a small sin. I've been betrayed, it's really not fair. I'll scream and yell till I get my way. I want my reward or I'll make you pay. I think we need security, guys. <clears throat> I'll take the magic movies all need to get a good audience, my warning now heed. I'll go into the films and hide it from you so the magic will go and the movies will too. No more comedies or big action sets. Romance will vanish, it's as good as it gets. So because you all have hurt me so much, my special plan will kick you in touch. Hello from up here, my plan is a dream. 
I'll ruin your night, I'll steal the scene. The magic I'll scatter through movies of fame. You'll never locate it, I'll win the game. If not all the movies that you like to view will come bland and boring, so what should you do? Bye, losers! Oh no, what shall we do? Without the movie and magic, all the movies will be dull and lifeless and no one will want to see them and there'll be no more movie stars. What do you think we should do in a situation like this? What about a song and dance number? That might solve the problem. Yeah! Leave this to me guys and star quality is just what is needed and I'll to lead the song and dance number and bring hope where there is none. They were so happy days, they are so hard to find With the movie magic you could free your mind Whatever happened to the dream, I, I wish I understood For the magic, it used to be so good That didn't work. How will I keep up my payments from my private plane, yacht, golf course and mansion if I can't be overpaid a few weeks of work each year? So who will go into the movies to save the magic? The Rock, you are a big action star. It's not in my contract. I could have a finger now and I've just had the manicured. No, 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 not me. It's too scary in there. There are big boys who hurt you and I bruise really easily. What about you, Tom? You've ma managed amazing things in the Mission Impossible movies. No way I need to meditate on the problem, then get advice from my many aides before getting a contact issue with the height clauses to make sure whatever I do, I seem three inches taller than everyone else. Then I need to study the role for at least two months before checking it will fit in within my schedule. Is there no one brave enough to go into the movies and rescue the magic? I'll do it. You? you? Sure, what could be so scary about going into the best movies ever to get some bits of movie magic back? Sounds like a great adventure. Gosh, you are brave. Gosh, you must have been in some great action film. Are you a stunt guy? Then who are you? Clive. Clive? Yep, yeah, I'm the cleaner. The cleaner? Yep, yeah, I'm the lead cleaner with Wildcat's cleaning services. You don't need to be a hero to actually be one. Anyway, I won't be going in alone. It's always good to have backup. Gosh, well, who would be daft and stupid enough to go with a novice like you? Yeah, you'd have to be a moron to follow you into untold dangers. Nice to see that you both are looking forward to it so much. Us? But I faint at the sight of blood. Come on, time is against us and we need to get moving before sunset. We can follow her into the portal through the world of films. Remember, no more movies means no more large paychecks. Let's go!
Yeah, in fact, it's drawing near. You can feel it in the force. No one is safe. Danger there is, safe we are not. We must be vigilant or the Imperial forces might locate us. Hi, quick, strangers there are. This line not off. Looks like Skeg Nest to me. You never know what we might find lurking in the bushes. Strange monsters that will want to suck our blood. Evil vampires that will attack us. Or oh, yellow old wrinklies and men in their dressing gowns. Be serious, will you? Welcome you are. No evil within, I feel. What did he say? I can't understand him. Home a long way away it is. Nope, still not getting him. Maybe he's Welsh. Friends we become. Allies, maybe. Pardon? We don't understand you. We are from planet Hollywood. The land of strange creatures at be. Escaped you have. Yoga is from the planet Pilates. He's a peaceful being who likes harmony within the force. We have many friends. There are the Blonde Onigan from Planet Blondo. The Ringos from Planet Donut. Forget not the Beetle Bobbers from Planet Volkswagen. And the Time Lords from Planet Gallifrey. Did someone call? See you, it is good, Doctor. Yoga, how are you doing, my mate? He's still keen to be green, I see. We're just explaining to these nice people from planet Hollywood about aliens. There are the good ones and the bad ones, but these lot, they'll be your best of friends. Yeah, the Ringos are reliable and the Blondagonians are the biggest laugh here in this side of Pluto 4. But you know they're all real radical guys, right? You can rely on them. Best friends they'll get in the universe. And I should know because I've been around it a few times. This is such a lovely place. Everybody is so friendly. It's the only trick into the Emperor. You are all prisoners. That's the movie Magic. Look! This is found by the Sith, the Dark Lords of the Universe, and now it belongs to the Emperor. But we need it! Never. Dark Side of Force is stronger. Darth Vader is dangerous. Pound his hands can mean the end of good films. Darth, you cannot win. Good always triumphs in the end. I am more powerful. You're as jealous, Yoga, because my actions are gout sells yours. The magic is mine, and I will use it to make me stronger. Never! Get back! Look, I think we 
a drop of blood. Mummy, mummy, I want my mummy. Have your movie magic if you want it. It's not that good anyway. Well, so this is Baker. I need a wet paper towel. Thank you, Yoga Doctor and Obi. We need to press on. May the force be with you. And with you, my friend. Before you go, take this. It's a screwdriver. A what? A screwdriver. But it'll tap into the force and help you find the rest of the movie magic. But a screwdriver? Okay, it's a sonic screwdriver. Can't get these from Amazon or e eBay. These things will do more than put together furniture from Ikea. These things are brilliant and I've given it to you. Thank you. Peace be found in the force. Still not understood a word. Oh no, a piece of magic they have found. I have to hide, go underground. Even better if I recast me. They won't expect and they won't see. My makeup team, I have a test. Transform me now, do your best. Okay, I'm here. Uh, this isn't going to be easy, you know. A bit over there, a bit over here. Oh, there we go. There you go. No one's watching. Oh, this is a bit. Thank you. I think to Victorian England I will go. Hide the magic in Oliver. They will never know. Ha ha ha. By Dickens, you know, I'm so clever and great. There's no way they'll get the magic. But wait. I don't believe it. It can't be true. Brad and Rainey are here. What on earth should I do? I'll nip into this workhouse. There I can hide. It'll be full of sweet children. They'll be on my side. Welcome to the workhouse life, a place for those in trouble and strife, where bed and shelter is what you get from winter old you pay and sweat. This is the finest workhouse in the land because it works at my command. Remember, Mr Bumble is my name. It's the hard knock knife for you, boy. What little boy? You maggot, I can see that you're addressing the service. It is the last straw, my boy. So finally I found you. Can I have a word? What is it? 
The boy. What will happen to him? That urchin. Well, he's out in the street headed off to London, I think. Bye. So, Oliver, are you enjoying it here? Yes, Dodger. It's so nice to be free from the workhouse. We'll look after yeah. you, won't we, lads? Yes! You know, Oliver, it's about learning their tricks and keeping one step ahead. Ahead? Yes, ahead of the others. The others? Yes, the others who would stop us. But stop us doing what, Dodger? I think I might need to introduce you to someone, my boy. This is Fagan, our keeper and our friend. Pleased to meet you, Oliver. Why do you look like a fine young lad? Fit of meat on the bone. I found him wandering with the streets with nowhere to go, so I brought him here. Well done, my boy. You did right. He looks a little tired and undernourished, though, but it'll soon fit in and do his bit. What's well, my bit, sir? Just a small bit, my boy. Don't worry about that now, Oliver. Consider yourself at home. Consider yourself at home. Consider yourself one of the family. We've taken to you so strong. It's clear we're going to get along. Consider yourself well in. Consider yourself part of the furniture. There is a lot. Screwdriver's pointing over there to the magic. Brad, this does not look like a safe place. Maybe you should keep watch out here. Yeah, sure, sure, sure. I'll be safe out here. <gasps> Welcome, good people, and who might you be? Gosh, wow, super. We're just passing through on a tour of the old England copper. Please don't do that. Up the apple and pear, me arty. No, really, please stop. We've lost some property and we're trying to recover it. You better hide, Oliver. They might be after us. Property is a valuable, is it? To us it is. And would there be a reward, a guinea or two, maybe should this property be found? I don't know. I ain't got no money. Come over here. Let's discuss it. I don't think we can help you, sir. We're just honest folk. It's Fagan. Not now, Oliver. Honest, hey. Well, we've all got to do our bit to survive. What you got there, Oliver? It's the movie Magic. I've been looking for that. Here you go, sir. Time to go, Rini. We got what we came for. You will look after this boy, won't you? Like who's my son. Then we bid you good day. Oh, Gratto Blast, I'm really quite mad. The magic they have, I'm feeling quite sad. Next time they'll lose, of that I am sure. The West will get them, they'll find no more. We're in the wild, wild, wild west. Sure looks well, I could do with a lick of paint and a good tidy up. Someone is coming, he might not be friendly. Run for your life, guys. It's Wild Bill Hiccup, the most wickedest, most mean outlaw in the west. 
He's more mean than Mickey Gunspinner the Wiz and even cruel than Claymore Crackshot. Hiccup will show no mercy. It's said that Hiccup has killed over 100 men just for laughing at a small problem. What would that be then? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> and you guys seen the sheriff? Because my band are not the meanest, roughest guys around. And I need to bring him down. No one gets the best of us. We're the quickest jaws and the sharpest shooters too. Everyone afraid of us? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're known throughout the West. And the East. Even heard us from Pats in Africa. Have they? Yeah, mate, they're in and out sight. Outlaws reunited. Oh yes, bring the last Rickle Girls back together. So moving. I met a last kid three times removed last week, and it was so touching because we had matching scars. That's so sweet. Back to business. <laughs> the main business. <laughs> I gotta beg me a sheriff. Tell us where he is and what not your butt. <laughs> Off! I, I think he's he's at the saloon. <laughs> Let's go, boys. Why are you all quiet? <laughs> you all scared <laughs> of me? You ain't gonna laugh at my fiction, are you? <laughs> so where be the sheriff? Come on, get out here. I'm gonna get you. I want the sheriff now, I'm gonna get angry. I'm here, Wild Bill, what do you want? I wanna make sure this town has no sheriff, so we can do what we like. Yeah, so we can cause our can of We can do whatever we want. Like having a big bouncy castle, eat too much ice cream, staying up till 10 o'clock. I'd like to pay all the houses, make the town more appealing. Later boys, now we have a sheriff to move from post. You know that won't happen, Wild Bill. <laughs> what you little pipsqueak, I'm gonna mash you in a pool, make you wish you'd never been born. But I'm gonna turn you into tick eggs and feed you to hungry kids. And now I'm gonna turn them into sausage meat. But after I've taken your legs off, I'm gonna play tennis with them. Wild Bill! What? Wild Bill, you ain't hiccuping anymore. My gosh, you're right, I'm cute. Oh, you're my best friend. You're cute, but you're amazing. Come on, everyone, it is a party. I want to see everyone up dancing. Now! In the Wild West! Yeah! Gee, I'm glad you're cured. You can go on being mean now. Hey, I've been getting bored of that. Anyway, here's something to say thank you. Found a way out in the prairie. It looked like someone was trying to hide it. It's the movie magic. Thanks, Mr. Wild Bill. Pleasure to meet you. Cup of tea? 
Why not? I'm thirsty. Shift! They seem nice. Sure did. Real genuine people. Yeah, the kind you want to invite around dinner. Ooh, shall we have a dinner party? As long as I can cook. Not beans again. Worst gas ever. Sure was. <sighs> oh no, not again! <laughs> What's that hurry you got there? I don't know. I found it in the Forbidden Forest. It seems magical. It's very powerful though. Looks just like a lump of silver to me. I can find that in the library for you. It might be a part of Philosopher's Stone. Better keep it hidden. If anyone sees it, you could be in trouble. Maybe a reveal spell will work. Do you think so? I've tried every spell I know. I think it could be a different kind of magic. Really? What kind? I think it could be movie magic. Really? Do you believe in movie magic? Don't you? Yes, well, we all have a bit of magic in us, don't we, Hogwarts? Let me try my reveal spell. What have you got there, Potter? Harry, hide it. We can't let Draco get his hands on the magic. Oh no, you're right. <laughs> Looks precious. Powerful what was yours is now mine, Potter. Give it back. Why should I, Potter? I'll keep the magic. It will make me more powerful. Use the Restorus. Bell Harry. That'll work. It'll send its the magic back to its rightful owner. To the other. Oh what? This is ridiculous. <gasps> well that was easy. Anymore. You're in the land of Oz. Why, what a colourful land of such wonderful people. We're the munchkins here at your service. It is so nice to meet you all, but I fear that I cannot stay. I must get back home, for my father will be waiting and will be very worried. Who is she? She's the good Duchess of the North. I'm sure she'll be able to help you. Well, hello, my dear lovely daisy, Chunk. 
Anyway, my little friend, how can I be of service? Well, you see, I'm from Ripon. Sorry, love. Got together, so you don't mind, do you? No, he never. She never. Really? Oh my gosh. What is it? Oh, a, oh, a house has dropped on the wicked reach of the west. Oh, that's terrible. Not really. She, she was so awful. It's a celebration. Whatever drop on that house on her is a hill. Where could she be? Could she be? I don't know. It's a certain place. My dear, your answer to your dining room is close at hand. But it's over there. We need to go over there. No, we need to stick together. Go this way. No, we can't go that way. I'm sorry, love, but I can't work under these conditions. Right. <laughs> Right, let's get started because I haven't got much time and this morning started soon. What do you want me to do? I need to get back home to Ripon. I need to return the movie magic. I need a good stylist. I think I need a good shower. Ooh. Wait, all of you, all you have to do is follow the yellow brick road to the Emerald City. The Munchkins make the way to the Emerald City, don't they? Yeah! What do we do now? We summon the wizard. What do you want? Oh, great Oz, we have travelled far to see you. I'm busy, go away, I can't help you now. Please, we really need your help. We need to get back home to Ripon. You are not wanted, I cannot help you. The dogs are ready, they need something to chew. You can't be so mean. They must be a part of you can see our need. We need to get back home. Look, my girl, I don't care that much. Take your third-rate actors, kick them into touch. Brad and Rini, what a pathetic pair. Get out now, I really don't care. How does the wizard know our names? There's something fishy going on here. I'm off to investigate. Please, oh great wizard, only you can help us. 
Look what I found here. <gasps> it's cakey. <laughs> okay, I give in. Do what you will. I'll turn myself in. I've had my fill. I'm sorry to all. I've been such a trier. I just wanted to be seen, to be loved and admired. I think you need to come back with us. It's time to face the music. But how do we get back? Amateurs, I tell you, you can know nothing. All you gotta do is click your heels together. And say there's no place like Harrogate, or is it Leeds? No, there's no place like... Ripon! There's no place like Ripon, 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 there's no place like Ripon! What you did was cruel and mean, but you did give yourself in at the end. We have a fit punishment for you, one that fits the crime. And no, that means ten years in Wormwood Scrubs, doesn't it? Nope, it means ten years in the only way is Essex. Take her away! Oh, please, I can't act. Anything, please. Anything, not Towie. And as for you, Clive Smith, you, my boy, are going to be a star. We've seen everything you've done on the screen and really have that special magic in you. Come to my office tomorrow and we'll sign the contracts, all right? Well, thanks, Mr. Producer. You've made my dream come true. Without you, Clive, we've never gotten the magic back. True bravery, worthy of any top-class celebrity. Showed what a star should be. It wasn't just me. It took everyone to get here. We were all in this together. the uh -huh. 